Hi, this is Rebecca Matthias, and I just wanted to send you this quick second uh, video tip in the series of leading visionary success tips before I head out the door. I'm headed to a workshop today where I'm meeting with other women and we're all co-authoring a book that's going to be coming out in 2012 about each of us sharing a story of a time in our lives when we were fearless. So I'm really looking forward to that and I'm sharing that with you because, well, one, I want you to get to know me a little bit better, but also because I think it leads nicely into what I will be sharing with you today. And the two, actually have two tips today, so it's like a bonus day. Um, the first tip that I have for you is to be conscious of whether you're in a state of expansion or in a state of contraction throughout the day. So the way that you might notice this is the state of contraction, you're going to feel tense, stressed out, you might find yourself complaining, things aren't working, you're frustrated, and when that happens, you want to do something that will help you to get into the opposite state, which is the state of expansion. So this might be taking a quick walk, you might even just sit and do a quick meditation, you could even do some breathing techniques and counting. Those are all things that can help you to shift. You can write down five things that you're grateful for because the state of expansion is where you're feeling grateful, you're feeling prosperous, you have a sense of freedom. And the other piece of this is being fearless. And that's why I was sharing with you about the book that I'm writing. So the state of being, how to be fearless. Fearless isn't an absence of, fearlessness isn't an absence of fear. It's actually where you do something new or you do something that sort of scares you or maybe it scares you tremendously and you do it anyhow. An example of this is when I first started doing a video on the internet, that, that was terrifying to me. And um, so that was something I had to just do afraid anyway. And then you grow into that expansiveness that the universe is asking for you to grow into. So think about something that you've sort of been putting off that scares you a little bit and choose to do it and you will be amazed at how much you break free from that contraction and move into the state of expansion. That's one of the fastest ways to make progress and it's also a key trait of a leading visionary success person. So moving into that, I also want to let you know today is your last opportunity to register for my Leading Visionary Women workshop this weekend. And you are going to come out of this workshop completely transformed with a business plan. You will have healed so much of your money history that holds you back from experience true, experiencing true prosperity. And so I really hope that you will join us. Tonight is the last, today and tonight are the last chance you have to save $200. And for details on that and to, to register right away, you can go to leadingvisionarywomen.com. And I also have two scholarships left for women that you might know, or perhaps you're a woman yourself that really wants to come to the workshop but just can't figure out a way to make that happen. And I just really wanted to extend two scholarships to women who are ready to come and have this transformation. And I really would love to see these scholarships filled. So if you know of someone, please have them email me at Rebecca at Rebecca Matthias. Dot com And that's spelled R-E-B-E-C-C-A-M-A-T-I-A-S dot com. Or you can hit reply um, to the email or put a comment below whether you're watching this on Facebook or if you are getting it in your email. I hope you have a fabulous, expansive day, and I hope that you enjoyed this tip and got value out of it. Take care.